here in our Studio 41 kitchen with recipes for coconut shrimp stew and tiramisu. <laughs> We've got Mama Cuisine. Hi, hey, everybody. Hey, Always good to see you. And by the way, did you rhyme that uh, line for me? Yeah, I, I wrote really that appreciate personally it. Yes. for you. Oh, it's fantastic. <laughs> uh, so you're a poet, you don't even know it, but <laughs> this really is wonderful food. It's comfort food. Yes. Why is this such a great thing to, to uh, prepare, especially if you have to hit the road? Yeah, so we want to, especially after Thanksgiving, all the heavy yeah, foods yeah. that we've been having, yeah. we want to switch it up a little bit, Yep. right? So I have here a pandan rum. So we love rum. There's lots of cocktails yes, happening, but we want to make not just cocktails out of it. Let's make some meals and I some desserts it. out of it. I love that. So let's make matcha pandan tiramisu. Tiramisu. So it's a very classic Italian dessert. Yeah. But let's make it a little bit Asian. Okay. okay. And, and pandan, you may not know, is a South Asian leaf. Oh. It's called the vanilla of Asia. Okay. So it's very good for these types of desserts. Yes. Gives you a little sweetness in yes. there. Yes. Okay. So you have here mascarpone cheese, heavy cream, and powdered sugar. Okay. And then if you want, Amy yep. or Jeremy, okay. whichever. I'll do, I'll do this Yes, one. and then you can help layer. The, the less under your kitchen, the better off everyone is. <laughs> I'm very good at uh, making food poisoning. And then let's so. add let's add a little bit of the rum in here. Is this oh. for the color or the flavor? It's or the, both. both. Okay. okay. Both. So if you want to smell it too, you could smell it and how it's going to be in the in the. Oh, I do smell. So it. you could smell yeah. it right away. So it's sweet, very oh. good for this dessert. And you'll see it. It'll tint it a little bit. Yeah. So Lady Fingers Classic. Yep. Mm -hmm. This is classic for for this right. dessert. We have some matcha tea. So usually the espresso. Right? right, right. So this time we're gonna do it with tea, and then we're gonna layer. And you're just putting them in different. And you're just putting in right. different layers. Okay. So often you hear about people that, that are dipping that in in uh, like various uh, boozes. E boozes, exactly. espresso. Okay. Uh, they do. You could do it with um, you know any kind brandy. Oh. Okay. So right. we're switching it up today with the pandan rum, right. with the matcha tea. Make it a little bit Asian. I didn't think I knew that there was booze in tiramisu. I thought it was just you coffee. Can, you can take it out. No. So oh, a lot okay. of people do it without. Yeah. That's my special tiramisu. Oh. <laughs> okay. So, okay. And then if you can layer that on top of here. Yeah. Yes. You gotta, I'm putting you to work. Right. Yes. Take it. Yes. Okay. Your turn. Yep. Okay. There's a spoon There's right a spoon there. There's a spoon here. Okay, so easy. Let me help yes. you. Yes. Okay. I'm We're hopefully not going to hurt people in this yeah, process. No, no, okay. right. We will protect you. You'll be Oh, thank you. At least someone is. Yes. Oh, that looks good. So, also the matcha is good for you too. The matcha is good for yeah. you. This is very good antioxidant. So, right. yes, we're always so really adding help. I we're love this. Right. <laughs> and rather when you're dipping that in sort of the, the tea extract here, does that give it more of a, like a lighter flavor? Yes, so it's, a, it's a lighter flavor, cool. and you know you can just add so many different things to it. Yeah. So tiramisu, you can get really creative. creative. I like you that. You can get creative with this. And then you could dust it with a little bit more matcha powder if you'd like on top. Okay. And then that's it. And then that's you it. let it cool in the fridge okay. for about four hours. But we could dig in now if you'd like. So okay. next over here, we'll do a stew. Okay. Okay, so the same thing. I have a garlic and ginger. So if you guys want to come here, I'll show you okay. how. Garlic. I don't want to get oil, oil on your dresses. Oh, is it I'll just do olive it. oil? Yeah, okay. just olive oil. Garlic and ginger. This is so fast and easy and simple and healthy. Yeah, it's like I see a lot of vegetables over yeah, there. Yeah, a, a good lot thing. of vegetables. Mm -hmm. And then what we're gonna do is add now butternut squash. Ooh. Okay. okay, turn this up a bit. Okay. This is one of those meals that you could just do a couple of ingredients okay. at home. Yep. Right. And I noticed that you've diced those up in uh, relatively small cubes. Yes. Uh, is that the About secret one to make? inch, okay, right. yeah. And the smaller you dice it, the faster it'll of course. cook. It'll cook. Okay. It'll cook a little bit faster. We'll add a little bit of this in here. Again, for that little bit of sweetness, shrimp is sweet already, right? But we're mm -hmm. just going to add this for a depth of flavor. Alcohol in cooking is the same concept of adding wine to something. But the alcohol cooks off, Yes. Right? So okay. that's why you want to do it in the beginning. Okay. So that the alcohol cooks off. Okay. I would want to get my kids, you know, right. and a family <laughs> they'll, go to sleep. they'll go to sleep much faster. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> and then we'll do this. So saute that. We're going to add then our green. Now, are you adding, are these going to get mushy or are they going to no. stay really crunchy? Yeah, they'll okay. be really crunchy because the shrimp goes fast. Oh, that's right. Yep. Right? Okay, the that's shrimp true. is very fast. So we have the green beans here. And that's butternut coconut. squash, this is coconut milk. Not cream, oh, right? Not cream. Okay. Coconut milk. What is the difference between them? One's just thicker than the other? One is thicker, one is sweet. Oh, so the okay. cream, oh, okay. that's how they make uh, different kinds Desserts of cocktails and, and desserts. Oh, yeah, okay. And then the milk doesn't have any, no, no sweeteners. Okay. No sugar. 
So you'll see here, and then you're going to let this simmer until everything is soft. Yep. Right? Until everything is good. And then you're gonna add your shrimp. Okay. To it. Now okay. you're adding shrimp already cooked. Yes. Well, no, you could do it raw. Okay, also. You can. okay. Yeah. This is already cooked so that it's just much faster. Gotcha. And, and for people who might not like the idea mm -hmm. of shrimp, any substitutes that you might recommend? You can do this totally vegetarian. Okay. Oh, yeah. You can do chicken. You can okay. do any kind of meat. Traditionally, it's with shrimp. Okay. Oh, it's okay. a Filipino dish, actually. And then it's going to really taste like curry. You know? Oh, yeah. It's oh, really okay. good. That sounds great. Because of the coconut milk. Ooh, yeah. And then when the, when the butternut squash starts to break down. And then I have some bok choy if you wanted to add more vegetables, mm -hmm. of course. We added a little bit of that rum. And did you make us a little uh, beverage over there? Yes. <laughs> and of course, yeah, there's a little beverage. So if like, you guys want to try, this yeah. is just like a little coconut cooler. Here. There we go. So what is this? So there that's the coconut cream. Oh. Mm. Mm. Cheers. Okay. Coconut Cheers, cream Chris. and the mm. rum on top. So you want to mm. make sure Ooh, that's that you sweet. swish it around a yeah. bit. It's very oh, sweet. Yeah. That's good, though. You, you should really try good. it. It's, mm. a it's different. It's very good. And it shows yeah. you you can make many different things out of it, not just cocktails. I love it. Yes, you can That's actually really use fun. it in cooking. Very, very fun. Thanks, Mama Cuisine. Yes, you're welcome. That's great. Let's see here. All right, up. make sure you can check out mamacuisine.com. Uh, more information, more recipes, and get all the details there. Thank you.